Okay, we're going to do a, uh, a linen wrap on a jump cue here. Um, it's small, so it should be easy to film and won't take too long. I've got the butt chalked up in a lathe, uh, it's hooked up on a foot control, so I can uh, control the speed of wrapping. I've got a linen tube here, so roll Irish linen inside the uh, tube with some silicone uh, on the end in order to keep pressure on the linen. Need some glue and some sort of a tool to separate and uh, make tighter the wraps. I'm just going to get go ahead and get started on this and hopefully somebody finds it interesting. Just want to make sure we got lots of glue. On the area where the linen wrap is going to go. To start this wrap, just do a crossover. Get it pretty tight. I'm just going to cut the excess wrap off. Tighten up the gaps here. Left one gap there on purpose so you can see how you can hide them in case you make a mistake. Very important to keep your eyes on the linen. So you keep it as tight as possible. Stop leaving about a quarter inch of free linen, a free Q space. I'm just going to cut myself a piece of scrap linen. I'm going to go ahead and coat that in Q wax because I'm going to use that as a lubricant. It makes it easy to pull my piece through. That's going to be the real tough part to watch here. This is where it, the hard part of this installation is finishing off the, the wrap. A lot of guys like to drill little holes in the um, butt of the queue and force the linen into it. But I don't like drilling next to the butt. Too easy to cause damage. So you see, I've wrapped this around so the linen is tight against the cutoff shoulder here. Now this piece of scrap that we've pulled through is going to bring that to that same spot that is tight. I'll put a little bit of wax on this piece of linen as well force it through the hole here, pull it tight, pull on these little tails, we're going to go ahead and pull this linen through. Now, sometimes we make it too tight, it makes it difficult. through there. That's why we put wax on there. So now I've got this tail. Go ahead and take my knife and cut that off. 
you might go ahead and see these gaps here. I don't know how well they're showing up on the camera. But we're just going to space, take some of these little wraps here and space that gap out and hide it. When linen goes on a butt, it's round. When it comes out of that tube, it's round. And we're going to flatten that. When we flatten it, obviously, uh, we take up some of the spaces. I just want to get them so they're even. I want to flatten those out. It'll be hidden up real nice. Now in order to flatten that out, I've got a special tool here. This is made by Creative Inventions. It's a, it's a linen press, Irish linen press. We're going to go ahead and smooth this out and make it flat. that off after it's all dried up nicely. And this wrap is on there. It's nice and flat. There's no more gaps. So what I'm going to do is uh, use some starch, some spray starch like we use on our clothes. And starch, put some starch on there. Then we'll use this little iron. Iron it. And make it nice and smooth. Burn it on there really nice. Take some 600 grit sandpaper. Just sand it a little bit. That makes it really, really nice and smooth. Put some more starch on there. That is uh, how you install a Irish linen wrap.